Hello guys, today I'd like to share with you classic Norwegian recipe of skulabola. Delicious buns made with custard and sprinkled with coconut. Very easy to make, just follow this step-by-step -step recipe. Hello guys, my name is Dimitro and it's 1001 calories. Every other day I'm cooking and sharing with you interesting recipe from all over the world. If you like them, don't forget to subscribe our channel and share with your friends and family. Let's get jump to the recipe. For the dough we will need milk, flour, egg, sugar, salt, yeast, vanilla extract and butter. Mix together milk, sugar, yeast, pinch of salt, mix together to dissolve, mix beaten egg, vanilla extract, mix all together, then put the flour, attach the hook for the dough and begin to mix it. Put butter in and knead for 10 minutes. Your dough is ready, place in a greased bowl and set aside to rise for 1 hour. Meanwhile to make a custard we will need butter, milk, cornstarch, sugar and egg yolk. Bring to boil the milk and set aside. In the mixing bowl, mix egg yolk with sugar till turns white. Add cornstarch and whisk well again. Add hot milk stirring constantly. Cook your mixture on a medium heat till desired consistency. Don't forget to stirring constantly. Add butter. Mix well to combine and set aside to cool. After one hour, place your dough on a lightly floured surface and cut in a six or eight equal pieces. Shape the buns Place them on a baking tray with the baking sheet and cover and let it rest for 15 minutes After 15 minutes, gently press the buns to flatten. And make an indentation in the center with the help with the flowered glass. Cover the buns and let it rest for another 30 minutes. After 30 minutes, make an indentation again with the glass.
brush your buns with the egg wash fill the center with the custard and bake for 10 to 15 minutes 180 degrees to prepare the glaze mix icing sugar and water After your buns are cooked, let it cool a little bit, cover with the glaze and then sprinkle with the shredded coconut and our buns are ready. Hope you enjoyed this recipe and I will see you after tomorrow with the new recipes from all over the world.